Hello everyone, in the Command and Conquer community there is an unsolved mystery of the unit speed. If you don't know what I'm talking about, well the unit speed system is very funky in CNC Tiberian Dawn. A popular example to demonstrate this confusing mishmash is to compare the speed of the Humvee and the APC. The Humvee has a speed of 30 and the APC has a speed of 35. That makes the APC faster, right? Well no. If you compare the two units in the actual game, you can clearly see that the Humvee is faster. What is going on here? Why is a unit with less assigned speed faster than a unit with more assigned speed? Well, in this video I will answer this interesting mystery. I hope you will enjoy this. So let's start with the basics. When a unit is given a destination, it travels through cells. There are direct modifiers that change the unit's speed. For example, if an infantry unit is threatened, it starts to crawl and it moves two times slower. If a technician is threatened, it starts to run two times faster, and if a machine gets damaged till its health bar is in the yellow or in the rain, its speed is three quarters of the original speed. This is all good and interesting, but this does not answer why a perfectly fine Humvee travels faster than a perfectly fine APC. So I knew it was time to investigate the source code. My first theory was that it had to do everything with the unit's armor. There are no armor, wood armor, aluminium armor, steel armor, and concrete armor types, but this theory can be easily debunked because an MLRS and a medium tank have different types of armor, but the same speed assigned in the source code and the same speed in the game. I hope that there are going to be modifiers that I could find in the source code, but I didn't find any. I cancelled this video at the end and moved on, but then in the file I thought had nothing to do with the unit speed, constat C++, I found this. This is the answer to our mystery. I'm going to quickly try to explain this code, so bear with me. So we have these kind of S thingies, these are actually hexadecimal numbers, if we take a look at what these values represent, we get these numbers. Now what is this? Well, this is beautifully documented code with a lot of comments, and by that we can understand that this is a table of some sort. If we make this more organized, we see all of the movement types and all of the cell terrain types, and they all cross at these numbers. Now what is this? Uh, these numbers multiply the unit's given speed based on its movement type and the cell type on which they are traveling. Now before we continue, I have to clarify some things that I found. The harvester movement type exists in the cone, but it is not used. Harvesters are actually wheeled movement type units. Clear terrain type of cells are just these normal grassy and these normal desert cells. Beach, Tiberium and clear type of cells act the same, plus the road cell type exists in the cone, but it is not used in any Tiberium dawn cells. These part cells are actually clear type of cells. Now with this information we can see why the Humvee is faster. Humvees are wheel type of units, but APCs are track movement type units. So with these given numbers in this table, we can calculate the actual speed of the Humvee and the APC, and we get these values. If you want to make these, these numbers more relevant, just divide it by 100, but this is just to compare which unit is faster in the game. So yeah, this is the actual speed value of the Humvee and the APC, and we see that the Humvee's value is larger than the APC. This is the answer to this mystery. There is a problem with these movement types that I can't really explain. Basically, a foot movement type is broken and acts very strangely. If we change the S value, nothing changes. It only changes if it's S1, aka the unit will not be able to move on that particular type of cells. So if I change this value to S6, for example, the movement speed will not change in the game. The same is with the winged movement type. But with wheeled and track movement type, everything is numbered, so if I change this to S5, the movement will be a lot faster. If I change, for example, this Tiberium cell value to S2 on track units, all track movement type units will go slower while traveling on Tiberium. Also, for some reason, the infantry unit speed changes drastically by the direction they are facing. This was documented by Jello6, go check him out. But yeah, this is very strange and I can't explain why the foot and fly movement types act so buggy. It may be that the movement mechanics are different between infantry, machines and planes because their speed mechanics are determined in different files, but I'm honestly not sure. Oh yeah, if you want to compare the actual speed of a tracked unit and a wheel unit, just multiply the tracked unit speed by 112 and the wheeled unit speed by 160. So, thank you for watching this, uh, I hope you enjoyed this and understood something that I said, because this honestly took a lot of research and time to make. If you don't want to miss any of my videos, don't feel pressured to subscribe. Okay, off with the waffling, bye bye, I hope you have a great day.